Horton, I saw some pictures of an interview with the most handsome old gentleman in, of all places, modern maturity. He still looks like a cross between FDR and Godfrey Searle, but of course is better looking than either. I write to tell you that I'm joining the lines of purposeful old ladies who are this minute marching toward Wharton with schemes of entrapment. You will admit that I've got a slight edge. I'm only 70. I came home in early September to help my sister Alice celebrate her 85th birthday, only to discover that she preferred to attend a bank director's meeting. With you working day and night and Alice not thinking of retiring, all I can hope is that you and she will be my guardians when I turn 80. The politics went to suit both of us, Clinton back in, and the start of what seems to be a real two-party system in Alabama. The party of George Wallace's students really needed shaking up, most of all in our state Supreme Court, which was a national laughingstock. I voted for the Libertarian candidate for president. His name escapes me, but his platform remains clear. He wanted to get rid of everything and start over. A word of advice, don't ever get your cholesterol counted. If you do, you will starve to death. Keep warm. You're devoted. Harper.